Assalamu alaikum. Namaste. Mola li madad. Hello, bonjour Montréal. It's me, Suella Niazi, once again on Fabulous Fridays. I have some exciting news for you today. We have a full program with not only just a talented artist, but a very good friend of mine. And we have some sneak peeks on a surprise on fun facts. So why don't we take a commercial and we'll be back with Bianca. <music> रेस्टोरेंट सात सौ छियासी बेस्ट पाकिस्तानी रेस्टोरेंट इन मॉन्ट्रियल हंड्रड परसेंट हलाल इतने तुम शाही पनीर दाल साग मिक्स वैज कड़ी पकौड़ा तो नॉन वैज में गोश्त लाहौरी फिश लाहौरी चिकन सीक कबाब का नाम सुन के तहे मूँह में पानी आ जाएगा फैमिली के ग्रुप वास्ते साडे ब्यूटीफुल रेस्टोरेंट में तहूँ बेस्ट सर्विस से फैमिली माहौल मिलेगा अज ही पहुँचो ज कॉल करो Hi everyone, so I'm back after a commercial break with Bianca Rosa. Hi Bianca. Hi. How are you today? I'm well, thanks. How are you? I'm good. Are you nervous? Um, I'm more excited than nervous. <laughs> okay, good. Because first of all, I have to tell you, you know your last name, Rosa. You know what that means in, in Urdu? What does it mean? It means fasting, which brings me to month of Ramadan, which is coming up very, very soon. Awesome. So Ra Ramadan <laughs> is a 30-day fasting period that we have. Okay. It doesn't mean we fast for 30 days. We fast before the sunrise and after the sunset. Mm. Yes. And it's, awesome. a it's a cleansing and a healing process as well. But it's a whole other story we'll get into later on. So I want to ask you a few questions, okay? Yes. So what do you do exactly? So my job, what I do. <laughs> my job. <laughs> um, I'm an actor and a singer. I'm a professional actor and singer. And I also teach voice lessons to children and teenagers. and Yeah, I yeah, find that extraordinary. For, <laughs> um, for someone in your age demographics, or I'm going to say she's between 20 and 30, that's all I'm going to tell you guys, <laughs> um, that um, you guys have opened up a school? Yes, we did. Which is a vocal learning school or is it a singing school? What is it called exactly? Well, it's not necessarily just vocals. We, we teach all instruments. Um, okay. Both my parents are musicians. Right. So it's 25 years that the music school is actually, well, 28, I think. Wow. Yeah. It's a long that time. That my parents own the music school. Okay. We started uh, in our home basement and now we actually have a location in Vimont. Uh, the music okay. school and where is, is Vimont? called... Uh, Vimont is in Laval. Laval, okay. Yeah. So our school is called Vimont Music and we teach uh, from all ages and uh, any pretty much any instrument that uh, wow. that is interesting. To, no, I think that's really cool. To Especially wants to a learn. family business that it has is. become like, you know, part of your yep. lifestyle. Yeah. So like they say, you know, you spend more time at work than you do at home. She actually spends more time at home and home because that's what I would call it. <laughs> pretty much. Yeah. And um, we're also going to show some clips of some of her students that she's teaching on vocal, yeah. on vocal yeah. or some instruments, which it's I'm awesome. really looking forward to. Yeah. And um, I want to ask you, so what mm -hmm. made you fall into this career? Was it because of your family and you just fell into it? Or were you were you thinking of being something else when you were younger? Honestly, I think it's a little bit of both because because both my parents are musicians, I guess I was just kind of 
born into it? Born into it. She came out with a guitar. <laughs> <laughs> Almost. Almost. <laughs> but I've, I've just been singing since as long as I can remember. Um, I would say what, like, my choice to pursue it is because it allows me to follow my creativity mm -hmm. and just let my creativity flow and yes. just being able to express myself. Yes. So that's why I continue to pursue it. I but, think that's yeah. great. I think a lot of people out there, I'm going to say, I hate it when people say struggling artist. I hate that word. Because yep. what are you struggling for? <laughs> to get noticed, to get paid, to mm -hmm. get recognized, to get you know, famous or whatever the case may be. I feel that every artist is an artist true to itself if that's what you want to be from the beginning to the end. I agree. Um, my background, obviously, you know, as a mm -hmm. fashion designer, interior decorator, it's, I'm not a struggling artist or a struggling decor artist. Mm -hmm. I do what I do because I love it and I'm passionate, just as you are. Yeah. And I find a lot of people out there don't know how to differentiate that sometimes. They're like, oh, are you a struggling artist? No, <laughs> I'm not. And you know, Nobody should be. Yeah. I think the struggling people are the ones that really don't know what they want in life. <laughs> Those are the ones that are struggling. Yeah. But um, I find it very fascinating that you get to teach children. And, and I guess in some aspects when you're teaching somebody, mm -hmm. regardless what it is, it gives you a sense of achievement as well. It right? does. It definitely pays off to see uh, to see them make progress. It just yeah. makes me really happy. Yeah, no, I can and, imagine. Uh, it's so rewarding. It's of course, yeah. absolutely. And children are our future, so I love starting them really, really young. Yeah. And then you see all the all progress. the growth and how they. Yeah. yeah. It's really nice. Yeah, there could be some superstars being born in your school as we speak, so we never I'm know. I'm pretty sure there are. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so the other question I wanted to ask you: um, You do a lot of events. I do. And this is where I met Bianca actually at one of the uh, fashion shows that was held in um, where was it in Laval? It was in Montreal. It was in Montreal, and it was an Italian fashion show for a mm -hmm. fundraiser. Yes. And I had met you through a common friend. And the first sight I saw you, I, I had designed an outfit for you too, which I had, you know, yes. made for you particularly just to have to sing on stage. It was awesome. It was awesome. Yeah, we'll show you a <laughs> clip of that as well. Um, it was amazing. Her energy, her, she's so clairvoyant and she was so passionate. Um, I'm going to say she's a lot in a small package. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That's the best way to describe it. And once you walked on that stage and sang, I, I, I mean, it was, the voice was just like, you know, you trembled Thank because you. you don't expect someone and I mean this in all compliment. You don't expect someone so petite <laughs> to have such a loud and intense voice. And it just kind of like blew us off. And we're like, wow. You're so funny. That's a lot of vocal right there. And it was amazing. And it was a great fundraiser as well. And since then, we have since become then. friends. Yes. Yes. It's awesome. And there's some hidden things about Bianca that nobody knows. Or maybe some people know. So, break ke baad, hum thoda sa aapko Bianca ke saath iske gaane sunayenge. Aur ek surprise denge. Acha. TK, we'll see you after the break. <laughs> restaurant 786 Best Pakistani restaurant in Montreal 100% halal. Ithe tusi shahi paneer, dal, saag, mix veg, kadhi pakoda te non veg vich gosht, lahori fish Lahori chicken, seek kebab, the naam sunke ta hade mu which pani a javega. Family te group to aste, sade beautiful restaurant which ta hanu, best service te family mohol melega. Aji poncho jan kalkaru, ponso choda, doso sutter, jiro saso shiasi. Pakistan to aene, Canada vich chaene, Pakistan to aene, Canada vich chaene. Did 
Canada restaurant 790 Jerry West Montreal Quebec Canada H39 1G6 contact 5144952110 and 5149919112 information Sayed Musa Raza Now that we're back after the commercial break, I have a super exciting fact about Bianca ko mujhe nahi pata tha. Lekin jab main iske ghar gayi aur maine ye dekha, maine kaha oh my god, tumhe ye zarur hai ki tum yahan leke aao to our studio. So I'm going to tell them that you have a very fun fact. Okay. It's something that no one would ever expect of you, right? Mhm. Mm Cuz supposedly you just went to a restaurant and they reacted they were in hysterics they were in hysterics so they they kind of freaked out so <laughs> the fun fact is well first we're going to talk about the history of this okay supposedly a long time ago maybe before christ i mean is this ancient legend from where it's an ancient legend from africa from actually. africa and yeah. what is a legend please tell us so a legend is basically a story can be true or or false or false right no one really it's like unicorns knows. Like unicorns, which I know they exist. Okay, go on. Unicorns totally exist. Totally exist. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I should have brought my unicorn slipper. Oh my god! So maybe next show we'll do that. Next show. Um, so, it's a story of uh, an African deity. Uh, her name is uh, Mami Wata, and she is basically a, a water spirit. And this oh. spirit actually. Um, She has a snake around her neck and the story is that well the story I mean the legend is that the snake represents it, the snake represents wealth and luck and all these prosperity things. I'm sure yeah. as well yeah, okay yeah prosperity so you're telling me the legend says that this woman or people of that era mm -hmm. used to wear snakes around their neck that were alive especially the royal like royalty so they were alive they were alive yep and what about the venom and the danger of it biting you well it was it was the ball python so a ball python okay. is a non-venomous species which most people keep as pets yep which we have for you today so we're going to show you a picture of what she's basically saying aap yep. aapko the seer dikhayenge jo jis legend ke bare mein bianca aaj baat kar rahi hai taaki aapko thoda sa samajh aaye hum kis taraf direction leke ja rahe hain acha <laughs> love it acha <laughs> okay now uh so bianca do you want to um Take out our surprise yes. visitor. Yes. Now, don't be afraid. We've all um, we've all handled this before. Yep. I just never have, and um, I'm going to stay totally calm. And what's nothing to be afraid of. What's his of. name? His name is Genie. Genie, like you know, Genie like, in a bottle. Yeah, like if you wanna be with me, <laughs> baby, there's no price to pay. I'm a genie in a bottle. <laughs> That's amazing. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> okay. <sighs> Wait. So, what kind of snake is this? This is a royal ball python. Okay. Royal because, royal. you know, of the the whole legend I mentioned wow. before. Feels like my boots. Really soft. I have boots like this. Yeah? Yeah. Awesome. I didn't kill a snake myself. Good. It, it died and then they made the boots for me. I'm d I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say for that. All right, so put him on. Let's see how sure. this works. Okay. Here we are live putting on um let's, a snake on her neck. Let's see if he'll unravel if for If he'll us. want to. And he's looking right at me. He might be a little stressed from the road. <laughs> uh, so she's taken him the first time in the car to bring him here. I, I was like, "What do I bring him in?" And then bring she went in. to a restaurant to go get food and they <laughs> saw it in the bag and they were, <laughs> they were all like, "Oh my god, she has a snake in a bag." So Okay. He's I think he's a little nervous. Can you cooperate with us, please? Thank he's you. He's a little nervous. Yeah, it's okay. <gasps> What if I do like this, like okay, a crown? Okay, that's so cool. Like, can you guys tell this is a real <laughs> snake? You can tell he's moving. There's no battery-operated toy okay. here. It's actually a real life. There, it's a headpiece. We're gonna put it as a headpiece. No. <gasps> oh my God. It's okay. I'd like to help you, but I think he'll he'll. This is actually happening right now. Yep. And there, there we go. It's in her head. Okay, so let's okay. see. Okay. Well, you can try. Let's just try not to rip my hair. <laughs> really? Really? No. Okay. I'm going to I'm going to Just hold. <laughs> I don't know what to do. He's this literally locked so himself in my hair. In her hair. So she's 
she's not going to be able to get. This I, is a little painful. Not okay, gonna lie. this is there. there. Imagine her driving down the highway like there that. There we go. Here, you, you can hold. Looks him. like a donut. Where's his face? His face underneath is right here. Okay, so I will hold him this yeah. way. Yeah. <gasps> oh my God. Here you go. This is. <laughs> I'm holding a python. He's actually. He's kind of cute. To be he's honest. cute, right? Yeah. My mom doesn't think he's cute. <laughs> and he has a beautiful pattern. So there are all kinds of morphs of these snakes. I'm going to kiss them. Sure. I just kissed a snake. <laughs> now that was, uh, I think that was, it's going to be part of my bucket list. Just kiss a snake. I just kissed a snake. Restaurant Sasso Shiasi. बेस्ट पाकिस्तानी रेस्टोरेंट इन मॉन्ट्रियल 100% हलाल इथे तुसी शाही पनीर दाल साग मिक्स वेज कड़ी पकौड़ा ते नॉन वेज विच गोश्त लाहौरी फिश लाहौरी चिकन सीख कबाब दा नाम सुन के ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਮੂੰਹ ਵਿੱਚ ਪਾਣੀ ਆ ਜਾਵੇਗਾ ਫੈਮਿਲੀ ਤੇ ਗਰੁੱਪ ਵਾਸਤੇ ਸਾਡੇ ਬਿਊਟੀਫੁਲ ਰੈਸਟੋਰੈਂਟ ਵਿੱਚ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਬੈਸਟ ਸਰਵਿਸ ਤੇ ਫੈਮਿਲੀ ਮਾਹੌਲ ਮਿਲੇਗਾ ਅੱਜ ਹੀ ਪਹੁੰਚੋ ਜਾਂ ਕਾਲ ਕਰੋ 514 270 0786 पाकिस्तान तो आए ने कनाडा विच जाए ने पाकिस्तान तो आए ने कनाडा विच जाए ने तेरा रेस्टोरेंट तेरा रेस्टोरेंट Montreal Quebec Canada X39 1G6 contact 5144952110 and 5149919112 information Sayed Musa Raza Ab hum aapko sunate hain ek gana jo Bianca gayegi hamare liye music ke baghair acha theek hai <laughs> Before the day I met you my life was so unkind but you're the key to my peace of mind you make me feel you make me feel you make me feel like a natural woman Was absolutely amazing that was really well sang without music thank you and you, you're like you, you your lips like what did you do before you went Brrr. what it was that about Brrr. what is that about to it's loosen just, your lips yeah oh it's, it's a little vocal warm-up very interesting okay so I, I think I should do that every time I speak mm-hmm. it's a good way <laughs> um, so after uh we're going to take a small break and then we're going to talk about skin care. You okay with that? Do you want to stay a little bit longer cuz I'm really enjoying your company? Awesome. Okay. I I don't mind staying. Okay, I good. I love your company as well. Oh, thank you. So we'll be back in a few minutes. Pakistan to aaye ne Canada vich jaaye ne Pakistan to aaye ne Canada vich 
it just it I don't kind know. of it it's protects kind of, you from the it sun. It protects you from the sun. The higher the SPF, the longer it protects you. Okay, so there she says. So the longer is the SPF, you should UFO, PMS, whatever the case, <laughs> um, it protects you from sun. Wear so sunscreen. Wear sunscreen. Because my grandma died actually from skin oh my God. cancer. Oh, yep. I'm so sorry. It's okay. okay. Thank you. Wow. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to take, so you're going to help me maybe in that coconut sure. jar. Okay. We're going to mix. Do you want to pass it to me? And I'll put, yep. So I'll put the oil. Do I mix it now? Yeah. Okay. Mix it. Obviously, we don't have a microwave here, but usually microwave down the coconut because, you know, when yep. coconut gets, I was going to say, when it the melts. coconut gets, yeah, hot, it melts. There you go. So you Is do this that. a good consistency? I think so. And then we're going to add the black seed oil, which is about two tablespoons. So four, Just keep mixing two, it. two of almond. Okay. And then two tables, two teaspoons of coconut oil. So mm. you mix it all up. Okay. Okay. And then you know how they do this, like in cooking shows, right? And then you have the product, which is right here. And Ooh. you shake it all together. Okay. And I usually let it heat a little bit before because I'm heating up the coconut oil, so mm -hmm. I let it cool down and I put it into a plastic bottle. Don't be mistaken, it's not lemonade. <laughs> but, you know, if you put it in your fridge, someone might think it's lemonade, <laughs> which would be quite funny. So how we apply this is basically... Give me your hand. This way? This way. This way? Yeah, just a little bit. Okay, we'll do it together. Rub it. Okay. Rub it together and just pat your face. We have makeup on, but it doesn't matter. Just pat your face. See? So that's it. That's all you're doing. And then if you want your hair to grow and have thickness and prevent white hair cells to grow, to white hair to grow from the cells, you put your head upside down and you basically massage your, you, can, you know, you don't have to do, do it now. now. No, you don't have to do it now because we're going to okay. get all oily. But, and we have no <laughs> napkins, so we'll just end up massaging into our skin. Is you put your head upside down and you massage into your scalp. So now mm. I'm just going to say it in my language. will be what, much shorter than English. Okay. So uh, basically, you put your teeth on the mix and you put it in the microwave in the microwave. And then when it's like this, you put it in the bottle. And you put it in the bottle. And every morning and every night, you put it in the mouth. You don't have to massage it. You don't have to massage it. The reason is that when you massage it, your mouth तेल भरा हो जाएगा तो अगर आप यूँ पैट करेंगे तो हल्का हल्का सा आपको मॉइस्चर मिलेगा आम, दूसरी वजह मैं ये इस्तेमाल करती हूँ अपने बालों के लिए आ, <coughs> आप अब जब अपने स्कैल्प को ये लगाएंगे तो आपका जो खून है सर में वो जनरेट होता है सो यू यू बेसिकली योर ब्लड सेल स्टार्ट टू जनरेट मूव बिकॉज यूर यूजिंग समथिंग ਸਾਡੇ ਬਿਊਟੀਫੁੱਲ ਰੈਸਟੋਰੈਂਟ ਵਿੱਚ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਬੈਸਟ ਸਰਵਿਸ 
ਅੱਜ ਹੀ ਪਹੁੰਚੋ ਜਾਂ ਕਾਲ ਕਰੋ 514 270 0786 like when you're exercising mm-hmm. when you're moving a muscle more than normal it becomes yeah, yeah bigger harder and and bigger and stronger so it's the same thing with your hair follicles mm. which i find amazing because you know at at the age of 45 now that i am oh. i have been doing this for <laughs> i have been doing this for a while and i find that's one of the reasons why people say why don't you have wrinkles <laughs> because i know you talk indian oh my yes, god you do you do i know you talk in indian do it just do it just for me come on Come on. I can't. Yes, you can. <laughs> Don't worry. No one's going to judge. When a brown person does an accent and is with a white person, it is not judgmental. But when a white person does it and a brown's not there, that is judgmental. I give you the permission. Do it. You give me permission? I give you permission. Say something. I don't know what to say. They don't know what to say because don't this know is how she say. is. When I met her, she used to talk like this to me, <laughs> assuming I only talk like this too. Right? Do you remember that? Yes. At the fashion show? Yeah. <laughs> so tell me, um, will you try this? Yeah. I just have to go to the store and get all yeah, get all, all of this can you find local uh local grocery stores but mm-hmm. I like to go to the homeopathic stores or the okay. you know because some of the stuff is not real when you go to a grocery store. Yeah. Don't buy this at the dollar store. It's not the same. No. I tried even to buy clove oil at uh like Super C. Yeah. And they said it's too exotic. We don't sell that. Exactly. That's but you know if we and I'll and I'll also put up a clip after just to show you the benefits of each oil combined together it becomes a miracle oil because I mean mustard oil if you use on your lashes mm-hmm. it makes them grow. Oh. Um black seed oil you can use for everything for um eczema oh. for a lot of skin diseases and dryness and this is really good you can even drink this oil. Wow. Yeah, it's okay. very good for you. Uh, it says on YouTube and again if you believe on YouTube the only thing it doesn't cure is death. Okay, whatever. Um <laughs> almond oil, we all know we all need peanuts. Okay, if you're allergic to peanuts and almonds, you cannot use this oil. Uh but this disclaimer. is disclaimer. Yeah, disclaimer at the bottom. Do not use it's really peanuts. Do not eat peanuts. Do not eat peanuts. Do not eat almonds. Use almonds. Almond oil. This is a uh, really good oil for uh nourishing. Hmm. Yeah. And then coconut oil is just good for everything. Yep. Putting nails. on your snail skin, hair. Uh, even if you take coconut oil and put like brown sugar and rub your Scrub. lips. exfoliation I'm telling you these at home remedies really work and I'm so excited that you got to do this this is my first like homopathic <laughs> or whatever you want to call it and um you know I think it was a lot of fun so I want to ask you since yes. we're on <coughs> on the show let's put mm-hmm. this aside what do you find if anybody wants to learn or become a singer or an actress what advice would you give the advice I would give to you is figure out your goal why why do you want to do this in life and then just take it from there and whatever whatever it may be i would say the biggest thing is to believe in yourself absolutely yep and a friend actually my makeup artist <laughs> oh yes who was your makeup artist my makeup artist is maria maria did a beautiful job from uh, studio mg in laval okay nice and Thank you. Yeah, she did do an awesome job. She did. <laughs> <laughs> and um she told me she's like, "Well, I was telling her at one point that I didn't believe in myself enough." And she was saying, "Why, girl?" She's like, "The easiest thing to do is to believe in yourself because if you don't believe in yourself, nobody will? else will." Exactly. exactly. And then, you know, my It's like the famous RuPaul saying, "If you don't yep. love yourself, who's going to love you more?" Or something exactly. like that. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly the something Not that I like watch that. all the shows. Something <laughs> something like that. Yeah. But um I would definitely say work hard mm-hmm. and uh you know because I see so many people that have a lot of talent yet they don't work hard at it and they just I kind of let also, it go to waste. Well, or, no, I think it's also the people that are around them that don't give them enough motivation or push them to their limits to become yeah. something as well because mm-hmm. you know, I mean growing up in a society today, everybody assumes that you should either be a doctor or a lawyer, which is fine. Yeah. You know, a doctor or a lawyer mm-hmm. or an, a physicist or a thor- what was I going to say, a, a psychic or sci- sci- scientologist, <laughs> psychic. sorry, a psychic. No, not a psychic, a scientologist or um a therapist, right? Yeah. Usually they're looking towards those types of fields, but mm-hmm. you know the funny thing is what makes the world go round is people who have artistic abilities to make us laugh. 
to make us cry, uh, <laughs> to give us that warm feeling and to give us mm -hmm. passion. I mean, yeah. you know, our, the artistic side of the world is compassion mm -hmm. because it's what we express in our clothing for me. Uh, in yeah. decor as well, and for you in music or in yes, acting. Yes, definitely. Yeah. So, are we going to see some future acting with you? Yes, definitely. Is there anything Pretty you want to tell us? Um, right now, I'm actually working on uh, some new music. Okay. I'm always writing new music. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm currently working with a DJ right now from Panama. So oh, that nice. Be pretty interesting. Wow. I'm pretty excited. And you're excited. writing your own song. I am writing my own. I think own. that's amazing. Yeah. Okay, good. So, I'm working on that. Um, I have been working on an EP album. It's okay. been taking a little bit of time, but I'm just, uh, I want to get myself together and work on myself a little bit more as an artist before releasing it. And I it. think the advice that you should always remember, and, I, and I'm not sure mm -hmm. you do, patience is a virtue. Yes. It takes a lot of patience to do Definitely. this. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. It doesn't come overnight. No. Some people have that overnight success, like <clears throat> a dog singing a song in Walmart, for example, <laughs> you know, or um, a baby running down the aisle naked. I, I don't know, like they have these phenomenons where they're instant stars overnight, <laughs> but <laughs> you do have to work hard to become who you are today. Yeah. And I am so proud to be a part of your life. Restaurant Sasso Shiasi, best Pakistani restaurant in Montreal, 100% halal. Ite tosi shai paneer, dal, saag, mix veg, kari pakoda, te non veg 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 ghost, lahori fish, lahori chicken, seek kebab, da naam sonke ta hade mu vich paani a jawega. Family te group swaas te saade beautiful restaurant veg veg ta hannu best service te family mahal milega. Aaj hi pauncho jaan kaal karo. 514-270-0786 Pakistan to aahe ne, Canada vich chahe ne Pakistan to aahe ne, Canada vich chahe ne Dera restaurant, Dera restaurant Montreal, Quebec, Canada, X39 1G6. Contact 514-495-2110 and 514-991-9112. Information Sayyid Musa Raza. Bianca, thank you. I think you're I'm glad you're talented. part of my life. <laughs> I think you're absolutely extraordinary, and um, even though we have a large age gap, you make me feel youthful. Yay! So that's, that's, she's definitely staying a part of my life for a long time, that's for sure. And we say in Urdu, we say, Inshallah. Inshallah. There we go. Inshallah. inshallah. So do you want to say, we're going to say goodbye, so you're going to say Khudafis. Khudafis. How do you say in Italian? Goodbye? Yeah. Arrivederci. Arrivederci. And thank you? Uh, grazie. Grazie. I know a little bit Italian. Yeah. Ferrucini. Fettuccini. Ravioli. Alfredo. Alfredo. How do you Mangia. say I love you? Ti amo. Or you can Ti say amo. Ti, vo te voglio bene. Te voglio bene. Mm -hmm. And in Urdu it's me. Me. Apse. Apse. Piar. Piar. Kartihu. Kartihu. Shukriya. Shukriya. There we go. So what from, she said. From Prime <laughs> TV. <laughs> Fabulous Fridays. I want to say goodbye and thank you so much. You want to blow a kiss to everybody? Yes. Mwah. Mwah. Thank you.
ریسٹورینٹ سات سو چھیاسی بیسٹ پاکستانی ریسٹورینٹ ان مونٹریل ہنڈریڈ پرسینٹ حلال ایتھے توسی شاہی پنیر دال ساگ مکس ویج کڑی پکوڑا تے نون ویج ویچ گوشت لاہوری پش لاہوری چکن سیخ کباب دا نام سن کے تہاڈے مو ویچ پانی آ جاوے گا فیملی تے گروپ سواس تے ساڈے بیوٹی فول ریسٹورینٹ ویچ تہانو بیسٹ سرویس تے فیملی محول ملے گا آج ہی پہنچو جان کال کرو پانسو چودہ دو سو ستر جیرو سات سو شیاسی